Hey guys, that Cuber. So today I'm gonna redo this unboxing and first impressions because the last video where I deleted already, there's some inappropriate stuff uh, was in the background. So I'm pretty sorry about that. And let's just um, say the thing didn't happen, and let's just get started into this video. So here we have the Gens 356 Air UM, um, the Moyu Weilong GTS version 2, and I got the Kanzame UQ for free because I purchased $60 and more. So without further ado, let's just get started with the Kanzame U 4x4. So my wood fly kind of died because I magnetized it and the pieces kind of can't move. There's just some error that I did um, and mistake. So like. Yeah, it, it it didn't turn out pretty well. So let's just get start um, turning this. I really like how the cubes, like how the stickers, like the sticker, the color scheme, and also the pieces are pretty nice. So without further ado, let's just get start turning it. This cube has like lockups where I'm not a pretty big fan of. Um, I really like the sound, but. The feel, I don't really like how the feel is, the feel performs, like how this cube performs, I don't really like it. Um, maybe I could like, just set this up and see how it turns. Um, this could be my temporary main, but not for competing and all, so. This cube is kind of an old cube, so I'm not going to talk much about this cube. Um, it is, it's kind of catchy, so. Yeah, that's all for this cube. The lock cups. Yeah. That's kind of all. And I can't stop turning this cube. Um, next, we're gonna go for the Real GTS version 2. Um, it's a magnetic box where I'm probably gonna keep this. Uh, it's a really nice box. It reminds me of like a watch box. So what we have inside here is this Team Moyu. Um, it's Lucas Edder and yeah, the only person or one of the person that I know in the team. Um, and the Moyu TS and some QR code you collect bring you to like their Facebook and their website. And there's not too much in the box. So I got this in stickless because I saw the black one which is the Whale and GTS version 1. So I didn't buy it. Uh, so yeah, the shades compared to a Volk, it's pretty different and stickless because in black it's pretty similar. Uh, okay, so this is the Moyu Magnetic Pyramids, pretty much the same. Yeah, so let's get started doing first turns. This reminds me of the MF3RS. Um, and yeah, not like the Whale GTS or the Vlog. The feeling may be like the Vlog or the GTS, but not the sound. The sound is kind of a bit cheap, but I'm sure I'm going to magnetize it and just see how it goes. Because I'm, because when the cube has magnets, it kind of like changed the whole feeling. Not the whole feeling, but the some feeling. Uh, but... Anyways, the corner cuttings, um, it's pretty nice. Corner cut, reverse cutting, 45, perfect. And just like the version one. Um, okay, so first the feeling is kind of like the Vogue and the Whale GTS, where I, everybody says that. But the sound is pretty much like the MFDRS. The how it performs is kind of a little bit, but not much. So. Yeah. Um, this cube, I could just uh, mess around and just do some solves in this, and I'm gonna review this cube and tell you guys what I feel about this cube. So that's all for this. Next, we're going to go to for the Gens 356 Air UM, um, regular Gens box and this pamphlet. Some GES springs. I believe there's purple springs in here, but I'm probably going to experiment it with a bunch of different springs to see what suits me, and I'm going to do a review.
corner cutting. Okay. The magnets are far more noticeable than the GAN 473. Which I don't really like get out of the box even though I tried much like a few different springs It's not my type and I never used this. I didn't use this as my main Just my backup so yeah So um, This cube like this Gen Air UM I'm probably gonna like experiment it with different types of springs um, and my I don't have a favorite, there's just some type of cube. Like sometimes I like it with the standard one, sometimes I like it with the yellow, sometimes I like it with the purple. So I don't have one favorite. It just all suits me. Like not all suits me, but different cubes has different type of feeling that it suits for you and for the GS frames, like if you guys understand. Um and this magnets are pretty strong and noticeable, even though I turn fast. I still can feel the magnets, and this one, even though I turn slow, I can't get the magnets. Um, so if I see Dana um, Yee's uh, review, I guess this is like the um, first one, which is the three times two um, and three five, and this one is like the four times two, the size because it's pretty noticeable. Um, I have nothing to say in this. I just have to do some solve and see what it feels, really feels, and how it performs. Um, and some uh, possibility that this cube is going to be my main because the, the stability is far much more better than the Gen 473. I'm gonna do a review on this and tell you guys what's the different be difference between the GAN 473. So I guess that's all for my unboxing. And I have did my first impressions and I don't know how I feel about this cube. Uh, I'm sure I'm gonna do a review on most of these cubes here. So you guys know how it really feels because most of these are new. So I hope you guys enjoy my unboxing, and once again, sorry for the last video, um, and I hope this video can be much more better than the last one. So thank you for watching, guys. I hope you guys enjoy.